Hey, I'm back with another update. So, just a little side note. I have achieved 600 subscribers. Yay, yeah, no. Alright, uh, real reason I wanted to talk about was, um, things that are become, gonna be happening over the next couple of weeks, um, or months, if you really think about it. <laughs> um, new games are gonna be coming in, uh, new walkthroughs. So, let's get started. Alright, um, Resident Evil 6 comes out in three days. Um, yeah, I'm excited. Um, I'm already playing. I, ju I just got the demo today, and I know I'm kind of late on that, but you know, I might I might be posting some demos. Um, just a little note. Um, other thing I wanted to talk about was um, Assassin's Creed 3 will be um, done after that. Um, then I will be doing Call of Duty Black Ops 2. And then after that, I will be doing the Halo series. I'm calling it my Halo project. Um, yes, I'm pretty sure I've explained this before. I will explain it again. I will be completing, or I will be doing Halo Combat Evolved, Halo 2, Halo 3, Halo 3 ODST, Halo Reach, and then by the time um, I finish those games, Halo 4 will have been out and I will have completed it. So that will be another one. So um, I've been kind of skeptical actually recently on how how I'm gonna be doing uh, my other series that I planned um, I know some of you asked for me to do the Paper Mario series which like I said I didn't have a problem doing um, I had to put it on hiatus, hiatus this year uh, due to the fact that I didn't have enough time to complete it before Resident Evil 6 um, so I am predicting this is sort of a challenge I gave myself um, if I can complete my Halo project, if I can complete all those games before mid-May of 2013, then I will do the Paper Mario series. Now, the reason I'm giving myself this challenge is because um, I am, I have also predicted, or not predicted, um, I am intending I intend on on doing um, Naughty Dog, you know, the company that made Uncharted. I am intending on doing their newest game, which is coming out next November, or so. You know, I'm predicting it's coming out next November. Uh, the Last of Us. It appears that they are they have they are done with the Uncharted series and are starting a new game, uh, The Last of Us. Um, if you haven't heard of it, I have a trailer and uh, I think I have a, some, a trailer and a demo um, on my favorites list. You can go ahead and check that out after this update. Um, it looks like a really fun game, you know, um, great graphics, I have to say, and, um, yeah, I uh, plan to get that done November. Now, I know what you're thinking, uh, the time between May and November is, yeah, it's, you know, kind of long, you know, six months, um, I doubt it'll take me that long to, um, get the entire Paper Mario series done, um, just a note, these games are long. The Paper Mario series is a very long series. All three of these games are very long. You know, I'm I'm even predicting that they're they will take 50 plus parts. You know, I've it's literally taking me a matter of weeks to complete a game. So um, I'm just trying to kind of you know compensate a little bit or whatever because if I can't if I start if I finish this Halo project way too late. And I don't have time to, um, you know, complete the Paper Mario series. Then I might not, you know, I might not be able to do it at all. So um, my second option, if I don't complete the Halo project, which um, I'm predicting is very unlikely, you know, especially at my rates, I might be able to finish um, at the rate of my uploading. I might be able to finish it in time. But let's just say, for example, I don't. Then I will be doing um, Red Dead Redemption. I will be doing that game with the Red Dead Undead Nightmare and then I will be also be doing um, Sleeping Dogs so yeah those three games if I do not complete um, if I don't complete Super Paper or if I don't complete Paper Mario Paper, or Paper Mario Thousand Year Door or Super Paper Mario if I can't get those games in then I'll be doing Red Dead Redemption Red Dead Undead Nightmare and Sleeping Dogs so um, that all depends if I can complete Halo um, in time before um, mid-May of 2013. 
So I'm not I'm not really worried about it. You know, either way, they're both they're, both games are really or all these games are really fun. You know, they would be great. They are great games for doing walkthroughs. And you know, eventually I will be doing all of these games. It's just a matter of when I'm going to be doing them. So that is just a note I wanted to make. Important note. Um, uh, fourth thing. Um, or not really fourth thing. I, I'm not sure I even numbered. <laughs> I don't even think I numbered these. Um, these updates. Uh, n sorry. Next thing I wanted to talk about. Um, I've been recently getting a lot of questions about um, various things about my channel, and I want to kind of um, go over them right now because I um, I have been getting a lot of new viewers over the last few months my feed has been going up and I think that's great so I want to kind of keep everybody up to date you know um, I want everybody to keep up with the program uh, everybody keeps asking me or a lot of people keep asking me if I'm going to be doing a certain game such as Resident Evil 6 or Assassin's Creed 3 everybody keeps asking me that I've announced before that I will be doing those games however if you're missing the update I have a list on my channel of what games I'm going to be doing in the order that I'm going to be doing I also have a list that you know keeps up to date what games I've completed, what games, what game I'm doing at the moment, and what games will be you know in the future. So if you're if you're you know confused on what I'm going to be doing next, go ahead, feel free to check the list. I, you know I, I put it up there for a reason, so you guys can you know keep up to date what I'm going to be what I'm doing. So um, another thing is people keep asking me what my gamer tag on Xbox or my PlayStation name is on the PS3, and I keep. I've got. I'm not. Or I, I'm think, I think I took the notice off my channel because I was running out of room. Because you can only put so many um, letters or characters on your um, channel info. I will not. I will. You. Okay. Um. If you want to send me a request on Xbox or PlayStation 3 for um, a request for the gamer tag or PlayStation name, you can f feel free to um, invite me. I most likely will add you. However, there's not a guarantee that I will play or m even talk to you. Simply because I don't go on the PlayStation or Xbox, I don't play online like online as much as I used to. And when I am playing on it, I'm usually playing with my friends, you know, my personal friends that um, and I don't always have time because I'm I have been getting more busy, you know. It's not like it's summer anymore and I get all the free time in the world. Things have been getting kind of busy lately, so odds are I will not be playing or chatting with friends from YouTube but if you feel the need to invite me or you know add me as a friend you know be my guest but I'm just letting you know that now and the last question um, that people ask me is what do you record with um, for your game for your walkthroughs all right so I'm gonna answer this and everybody knows now who's watching this update I record with a dazzle DVC 100 it's the standard type uh, the program I use to record my gameplay footage is Pinnacle Studios 12. Um, for commentary, where I use my voice, I record using Audacity. And I use the studio to mix in my audio with my video, and that's how I use. That's how I, um, that's how I record everything that I do, that you see on my channel. Um, another thing, um, somebody asked me this, um, are you going to be upgrading to HD? Um, no. Um, as nice as that would sound, <laughs> I would love, personally love, to upgrade to HD. But there are a few variables to um, why I will not be recording in HD. Uh, one of the reasons is um, because I can't afford it at the moment. You know, I'm literally the only device that you can really use to guarantee that you'll get HD footage is a Homopog HD PVR or just a regular HD PVR whatever one you want to use and they are expensive a minimum cost for a good one is around 200 bucks um, you know right now I don't have a job um, I'm going to school so I'm, I'm literally making no money at all I'm lucky that you know um, I'm able to aff or I'm getting you know some money to pay for my games that are coming up, let alone trying to afford, you know, an, an HD PVR, the cost. And even if I did have the money, this is another um, reason why. Even if I did have the money to um, afford the HD PVR, my um, PC that I'm using, you know, the really old P PC that I used to update or up, or yeah, record 
my um, walkthroughs, it doesn't have the requirements needed for the space. So if I used my computer that I use now, it would literally slow everything up. Um, you know, the audio would be screwed up, everything. It just, it just wouldn't work. So um, that's a reason why. Um, and it's for a very small, like, feature, I want to say. Or not feature, my bad. Um, yeah, I don't want to say it's not for a good cause. It's not like I don't enjoy doing these things. But I'm not really getting paid to do walkthroughs. So it's not, it wouldn't, in my opinion, it wouldn't be worth it. You know, I'm, I'm pretty satisfied with the 480p quality that I have now. Um, I hope that you guys are satisfied with it. Um, you know, recently I had to deal with my 360p quality, which wasn't that good. But I was lucky enough to um, find a setting on Pinnacle Studios 12 that lets me um, record in 480p quality. So, um, yeah, I'm um, sorry if you don't like it, then you know, I'm, I'm sorry. There's really nothing I can do about it. Um, I hope someday in the future when I can get a job, I might be able to afford that stuff. But however, at the moment, you know, sorry, you're going to have to deal with it. <laughs> um, I believe that was all I wanted to talk about. Um, this is actually a pretty long update, I'm not going to lie. So, um, yep, get ready for Resident Evil 6. Um, and with that, I guess I'll see you guys later. Stay gold.